This is just a quick demo to show how parts work within the Requirements Composer tool. Uh, if you go to the JKE Banking Requirements Management Project and scroll down to the Business Recovery uh, Matters and the Parts under the User Story Elaborations, you'll see that there are several artifacts that exist, uh, one of which is Accounts Overview. If you open that part up, you'll note that within that there are several line items uh, identifying the account types. Now if we go back to the previous screen and we look at the actual user interface sketch and we look at the accounts overview page, we will see that within the page the accounts overview part is being utilized to show uh, the again the account types. Now if we note here the checking account information is at the top of the list and a savings account is at the bottom. We're just going to take a real quick example here and show how uh, a part can be manipulated and uh, and change how the, uh, the the user interface sketch looks. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and edit the part. by selecting the line item and simply moving it down to the last space. Once I've done that, I'm going to save that. And now if we close out our artifact, we can go back into our original user interface sketch and we will note that the checking account is now no longer at the top, it is at the bottom of the, uh, the, the account overview page. So very quickly and easily we, uh, we can change any part um, and impact all the drawings and all of the other artifacts which contain those parts with a very simple modification of the original part.